Welcome back guys. So today we're playing um, this lovely little game that I played uh, for the past couple of days called Atom Master, which is quite beautifully designed game, very nice uh, artwork on it. Um, so the goal of the game is basically to get your ship, they're not actually pirates, to get your ship across the seas over to the rightmost card where there's a piece of land that you're supposed to reach and if you do that you win the game but not as not quite that easy because a lot of things can happen to your crew along the way so we'll see how it works let's have a look at the cards first so these are the uh this is the seas um, so the types of waters you could go in, um, the regular calm sea, which is just a little circle with nothing in it. So it will cost you two navigation points to move into that circle. Um, <clears throat> we also have the fog, which are these. For those you will have to pay three. The ones with the land in it, so the islands, those will cost you three. And then we also have the currents. So the currents will cost you four. Unless you're moving into from the direction the current is going, then it will only cost you one. So <clears throat> much easier to move like from here to here and then here than it is going this way. Uh, that will be four and this will only be two to go all the way across here so you got to kind of plan your um, course carefully and those are the uh, the C cards for the uh, cards that you have in hand so the, the cards on the bottom are the ones you have in hand and this is the adventure row for the hand um, what's important is this number which is the navigation points. So have one, two, and three, so altogether six. So you would pay these by discarding them, and then you can move your ship. For the adventure row, uh, what's important is these, these icons on the side. So the, uh, <clears throat> the fire one um, is means unrest so the crew is getting restless it's uh, they're not happy um, the ones with the skull that's like a disease spreading so it could be any kind of illness on the ship and this would be it looks like blood but I think it's sweat so that's how tired they are so if in these uh, three cards you have five of fire or five of skull or five of sweat one of the bad things will trigger so the crew will not be happy so one of the bad things will happen also if you have three of each then the crew will riot and we'll lose the game so notice that <clears throat> it's quite hard for that to happen because there's three icon stops on every card so to get three of each um, it's not this doesn't really happen but also at the end of every turn the rightmost card gets discarded and if it has one of these icons on the side then it's played here and it will stay there for the rest of the game and then there might be several of these icons that you're gonna add with all these icons and that could make you um, trigger one of these bad events or lose the game so it's very important to control these cards because if you see some of these cards don't have those icons they have a skill listed if these cards are on the right and get discarded then they just go in the discard pile so we want to get these cards to the on the right hand side and not these so that's very important to control those all right we also have the <clears throat> weather icons over here on top so the three cards in the adventure row they determine what kind of uh, weather we're having and you'll also see that there's some black clouds here on the sea so if you're 
um, starting your turn in the black cloud then all of the white clouds turn into black clouds and depending on the weather it might be harder to navigate and you also get less actions if it's a storm okay so enough of that let's uh, let's begin the game and see how it works so we'll um, start right here with our ship and first thing we do is we check the weather so right now we have a sun with two clouds and we can see that just means it's cloudy we get three actions so we'll take three coins okay <clears throat> so uh, we have three actions available um, that's draw a card from the deck exchange a card with one in the adventure row or move the ship so since we said we're going to try to control these cards that have a symbol on the right so let's uh, do that first so we'll spend one action to exchange with one of our cards that has a skill on the side so we'll exchange that now these cards are always ordered uh, with these numbers in the bottom left corner so starting with the highest on the left and lowest on the right so right now we have all three that have a skill on the side so nothing will be added so we still have two actions so I say we draw a card so we'll use one of them to draw a card and with our last action we can we can travel a little bit so it's uh, important to um, get to the to the right rightmost card so let's see um, looking at the map we can go with the current so that will go that will be one navigation point and two and then we can explore this island so that will be five so this is one this is one and this will be three so altogether five um, I have six so we can pay uh, five to move all the way to this island so let's do that so we're moving all the way to the island by paying five okay and we're gonna discard okay so when we come to a, an island we can explore it so you'll see the number two right here like this one has a one this one has a two and it could be a three so when it mean what it means by two is we draw two cards and we can keep one of them and we also trigger the land bonus so we can find the beautiful landscapes which gives us two morale or fresh water which removes one disease trauma we don't have any traumas here on the side so this one doesn't doesn't do anything so let's uh, find beautiful landscapes and that will be to morale so morale is the deck <clears throat> so once the deck runs out the morale of the crew is gone and they will riot so we'll put two cards and the second card we drew and that goes on the bottom of the deck All right, that's all our actions so now we can proceed to the event phase so we'll check the events so do we have two morale icons we don't have any do we have five fire we have one two three four do we have five disease we have three do we have five sweat we have one do we have three of each we don't so nothing is triggered all right and now we'll discard the rightmost card does it have an icon it doesn't so it goes in the discards and we'll add a new one and we organize them by number 
and that's how turn of the game goes and so now we can um, <clears throat> focus on playing the game so let's begin so first we'll check the weather we have two black clouds so that means a storm and storm uh, lets us only have two actions now and we also um, it costs one more point to navigate from one space to another so with two actions um, we don't have um, any of the icons on the right so we don't have to worry about that so we'll just draw a card and we could navigate um, one space but it will cost us three hmm. okay well I guess we have to get going so we'll spend the second action to navigate so three navigation points will lead us to the next space up here and then we can flip the next card and join it up Okay, <clears throat> that's our actions. Um, so check for the events. So we don't have any again. And we can discard. So this one doesn't have a icon on the right, so it goes to discard. We'll add a new one. There we go. And we're ready for the next turn. So um, it's still storm so we only get two actions still costs us uh, one extra navigation so let's try to get out of the storm here okay let's see we're gonna need to draw a card so let's draw a card uh, just one so we can't even move um, Yeah, these two, uh, these two storm clouds are going to stay with us for a long time because they're high numbers. So let's, um, let's try drawing another card. Okay, nothing good. Okay, that should be that. Um, so no event yet, so we'll discard a card. Draw another. Okay, so we're still in the storm, so we still get only two actions. We could navigate, but we're, we're, we're still going to be in the storm regardless, so we're going to have to do something about that. Let's draw a card. Mm, it's no good. Well, I guess we can do that then. So we'll just um, exchange this card for this card. So that's going to be our second action. That gets rid of the uh, storm cloud. So this will go here. Okay, that's end of our turn. So uh, no event triggered. Actually, we have two morale. So that means we can learn one of the skills. So if you look at here, this skill costs two morale, and we can cancel one storm cloud, which is just what we need. So we'll <coughs> learn that skill. Okay, so this one gets discarded. It does have an icon, so I'll go right here, and we'll draw a new card. Um, 30, so that goes here. Okay. And we can begin the next turn so right now it's sunny so now we get three actions okay and now we can get going so let's draw a card for one um so we don't have anything with um with skills on the side so we can prevent this fire so we'll just go with it so we'll uh, draw another card ok 
Okay, and then we can navigate. So let's have a look at the map. So we're right here. Um, let's see. We could go two, three. No, two, three. Hmm. Three. Four, five. Okay, we can get to here. It will cost us all the cards. But they're all crap anyway, so let's just go there. So we're right here. Actually, I can't even see where I'm at. Okay, there we go. So that will cost us all five cards, because they're all one each. <clears throat> okay, that's our action. So let's check for um, events. There's three skulls, two sweat, and two fire. So we're still good. Um, this one gets discarded. And we draw another one. Okay. So right now we do have three fire and three skulls. And two sweat so we're one sweat away from a riot so we might want to <laughs> keep an eye on that um, the weather is cloudy so we get three actions okay um, so let's try to prevent this fire so we'll uh, one action to draw a card that didn't help one more to draw a card didn't help so let's see um, so fire and we have three so we're trying to prevent uh, fires okay let's just roll with it because um, we can't prevent this fire from going in so we'll just see what happens next um, for travel, we could go into this fog for three, so let's do that. So we'll play this card, three navigation, we'll move up here in the fog. Okay, uh, for the events, we don't have anything, we're still one sweat short from a riot. And this one gets discarded, so now we have these icons and this one is not doesn't have an icon so that's good okay let's begin so we do have two storm clouds but one we can cancel one so that's not going to be a storm so it's just going to be cloudy so we'll get three actions okay Let's check the icons. We have three skulls, three fire, and four sweat. So that's going to be a riot at the end of the turn. So we got to prevent that. So let's draw a card. That could help. Let's draw another. Okay. We have to use the last action to exchange, so um, let's see, we have three skulls, four sweat, and three fire. Okay. So let's, okay, I, okay, I think I see a good move. So, if we play this one, instead of that one, then we'll only have two sweat. Oh, but we'll have five skulls still. Okay. So, we have to take off one skull, or one fire. Yeah, right here. We can take off a fire right here. There we go. So this one actually goes here. Uh, 
Okay, there we go. That's our last action. So, um, two fires only, four sweat, three skulls. So we're good. Also two uh, morale icons, so we can learn another skill. And I do have this one. This one will give us a land bonus. This one gets discarded because it's uh, no icon here. So new card is drawn. Storm. Okay, so next turn we have two storm clouds. We'll cancel one, so that makes it cloudy. And we get three actions. There is five sweat icons, so that's bad. So let's draw a card first. Okay. We'll exchange, I suppose. So we'll exchange this one with this one. I think that will be three fire, three skull. Nope, that's no good. So we can't put another fire on there. <clears throat> hmm. We could exchange it with this one. Three skull, three so three five. No, we can't put this one on any anywhere. Oh goodness. Okay. Let's draw another card. It's just a skull. Okay. Well. We have to take off at least one sweat and we can't add two skulls and we can't add no we can't add two skull in a fire and we have to take off at least one sweat so let's take this one off and we'll add this one yeah that sounds like a plan Okay, uh, so um, no events triggered, so we can just discard this card. See, now it's becoming a problem. We'll draw a new one. Okay, this one goes here. All right, and we have to uh, discard down to three cards, so we'll... Yeah, we know we can't use this one, so we'll just get rid of it. Okay, so the weather is sunny. We get three actions. Okay, let's check. We have three skulls. Uh, we don't have three fire, so that's good. So we just have to avoid getting another fire. Let's draw a card. Okay. I think we gotta get some land because we need we need to do something for the crew because they're they're about to riot. So let's let's get going. So let's draw another card and let's navigate. So we'll spend all our cards. We got seven, so seven navigation points. Um, it will take us two to get to here, and we still have five. Let's check. So we're here, five, here's two, three, four, we need the land, five, two, three, four, we can't get to the land, uh, maybe next turn, so let's go down here, so we'll end up here. No. Two. See, so we can go two, five. Okay, we can get to here. So let's get here in the fog. Okay. So that's our actions. Let's see the crew. There's four skulls. 
two fire and four sweat so we're doing pretty bad um, this is gonna be another skull added here next card scurvy sounds great okay right now there's four skulls five sweat that's bad two fire we didn't lose yet but it's pretty bad um, the weather is cloudy we get three actions so we need to navigate to that island as soon as we can so one action draw a card two we need three other action draw two and we'll navigate Go to that island. It has three, so three cards. Okay. Nothing to help us. Hmm. We can restore two morale. That doesn't do anything. Let's reveal reveal all face down map cards so we'll do that one so we know where we're going okay there we go so this is where we have to go <clears throat> okay we've done our actions let's see the events uh, no morale unrest um, only two that's fine uh, disease is four, nothing. Tired is five, yes. Okay, so tired crew. Um, we lose three morale. Yeah, we pushed them too hard, so three morale is discarded. Okay, we didn't lose yet. There's no riot, so they're just a bit tired. So the morale goes down, but we're still good. Okay, this one gets discarded, um, no icon, new card is drawn, okay, so they're not tired anymore, <laughs> um, yeah, so the only thing, we only have two fires, so that's the only thing that's keeping us, so there's no unrest among the crew, so that's the only thing that's, keep, that's keeping us from the crew rioting. Um, the weather is cloudy, so we get three actions. Okay. okay let's see how we can turn this around um, we definitely have to um, visit this island so we'll draw a card we have three that's enough to move here we need another two so let's draw another card Okay, and let's travel. So we'll spend these cards, five. So we'll move here to this island, and this one only has a one. So we'll draw one card, hope it's good. Plus two morale. Yeah, we need morale, because this is the last card. So we'll return to. Okay, um, so as we said, there's no um, events triggered so this will be discarded goes right here and new card is drawn not good so we have enough for disease and for the tired crew um, not enough on rest yet the weather is still cloudy okay so we need uh, three to move to the next island so let's spend one Okay, we'll navigate to the other island. Mm, that's gonna be the last card. Yeah, we can't do that though. We can't do that. We're just gonna have to navigate. We're just gonna have to make a run for it here. So we'll draw a card and make a run for it. That's all we can do. Land bonus was plus one card. Oh, forgot about that. Okay, um, we'll draw another card. 
and make a run for it. So we have five. The morale is all the way down to zero, so we can move three, four. Yeah, we can get all the way over here with five. Three, four. Three, four, five, six, mm. two. Nope, that doesn't help. Yep, we can only get to four. Yeah, we can only get to here. So that's as far as we can go. Okay, um, <clears throat> there's no unrest, but there's disease. Um, so we lose one morale for every. Uh, disease card which is five and morale is gone and we'll lose the game man <laughs> yeah you really gotta control these cards yeah, as long as you control these you can you can pretty much just breeze through easy and normal mode but on the hard mode the morale is a problem it just goes down because it's a, such a long journey see if we were playing in a normal mode uh, this island would be here and we would win but with the hard mode you still have a long way to go and no morale so you you kind of have to let some of these go through and just head head for the um for the end yeah that's why they call it a hard mode i guess but anyways a lovely game highly recommended um i did find the normal mode to be too easy but as you see on the hard mode that's when the uh, challenge begins also a lovely addition that I am about to show you so all these um, cards so you have three end cards so you don't know where you need to go at the end and a bunch other um, C cards that, so it's, every time it's different but you also have the uh, historical cards um, so uh, this is another mode you can play so you can basically just place these as so and so you basically go from uh, Portugal and you have to travel around Africa and go all the way to India here and this is like how the uh, Portuguese did during the age of exploration so you can replay their journey and uh, this I think it's much longer than mm, I think so because that one is five that one is five and you have one two three four so that's like 20 and this is I think it was 17 so yeah it's almost as bad as the um, hard mode but it's much more narrower around here and much more storms so it could be more challenging but i think it's kind of on the level with the hard mode but yeah you can tr all right so so much uh about that game adam master try it i'll leave the link for the uh, files and thank you for watching i'll see you in the next one